All right, so we are giving this a try. All right, so we decided, since I practice outside of our normal sessions, on occasion, I've done it more and more recently. I didn't used to do it. So since we're practicing, and I don't know how much of this I'm going to share, so you may or may not ever see this, but we thought we might want to film it. And so my... Since I'm trying to concentrate on more than one thing at a time, which is not my strong suit, I will try to talk as much, but I'm going to... I don't know what I'm going to do here, but we'll see. We'll see how this works. Little that. So Robin said that when he when he does his stuff, speaking out loud, I don't want to get toxic here. All right. Every time I jump, I I don't think I've ever jumped on purpose except for when I've been told to. So every time you see me jump. It's because my thumb is clicking that analog stick when I shouldn't be. All right, so we're going to go after this. Was This is right after, I'm practicing right after uh, we did a couple of runs at this boss. I haven't really gotten. Oh, this is. Awesome for him. There's there's one swing that he that he does that. And then there's another swing that he does, where it's two. Didn't get out of the way there. Where there's two swings. And I don't think I quite have those down yet. Like there, okay, I, and then this talking bugs the shit out of me. So that one, I think, is the, the big one that I de just dodged a couple of times. Ah! And I don't have Robin to tell me that I'm... That's twice in a row I've drunk! So obviously when I'm practicing here, I'm not trying to beat it. I staggered a little bit there. My biggest, my biggest thing with this, with this boss, who I think is actually really fun, uh, it's the first boss that hasn't really pissed me off, the challenge of it. At some point, it's just been like, wow. The thing is, like a lot of these bosses that I've found... Oh, shit. So now I want to... Ah, I just missed... I just missed some good swiping. Some good free swiping there. And what Robin said was to stay behind, and I know that I've practiced other times when it gets like this, where I'm, I'm, I kind of wind up just sort of when, when it freaks out, I'm rolling, and then I just kind of stay with him, like I'm doing here. He says as he, and that's the, the other thing about this, is that all of a sudden you're just dead. And then keeping up with it. A lot of it, to me, feels like it's like hit and dodge, swing and dodge. Ah, and I never get that. Plus, I, I think I was, I think I hit my drink by accident. Sometimes I still button panic.
and then I get going like this, and I'm like, boy, this is, I'm doing all right, you know? I'm, I got five S just left. He's, I feel like I, see, I can't even find myself now. See, I, I feel like I could beat this. Uh, he says as he gets, oh my God. Laid out. Ah. Wow. And I was trying to get him down a little bit more, too. And I had three S's left and two swipes and I'm gone. <laughs> that wasn't a very good practice session. Actually, that wasn't bad. But again, I... But you don't... The, the tough part about training like this, practicing like training, practicing like this, is that Sometimes I, I could I, I know I could beat it and then I can't and then like uh, what was it with the uh, Burial the Valley Dancer there was the one time that I um, and I rolled instead of swung if I swung I would have beat her I lost like maybe four or five more times and then I went in and we decided that I would just go and try to beat it on my own so we wouldn't take up ten ten times so I went from from really I just a complete screw up all I had to do was swing one more time would have beat her wound up losing to her what 15 more times before I beat her again so that's what that's the one thing about doing this that that's kind of tough for me is that sometimes I come back and I'm like I'm, I'm, I'm feeling really confident here and then I just go and get destroyed because some of these wasps obviously you know you guys know better than I do get you get you quick I'm gonna try one more one more practice run before we shoot our next episode next Hopefully a few episodes. We usually try to shoot three or four episodes in a session. We're changing the way that we that we used to do it. We're a little more deliberate about the start and stop of everything now instead of just sort of playing and carving out stuff. So go. And uh, and I've I've got a pretty decent beat on this. On this boss, it's just those random things that get you. Honestly, getting to the boss is the biggest pain in the balls. I miss those, uh, <laughs> it's those, the quick jaunt to, what is it? Mer Merakee, uh, Parakee, Calamie, Calamie? Love that. That was just a quick little zip and go up and all this stuff and not this. Purple mist, not that. This one, this one gives me about eight, eight chances for Robin to yell at me before I even get to the boss. Like here, when I'm about to. Ooh, didn't do it. Can I get out of here without? I did. Did I? Okay. Without getting. Okay, and I'm jumping. We all know what that means. Kevin's got a wiggly thumb. I hate it when you hear them stomping around behind you. And again, because I jumped instead of just rolled, because I'm panicking, now I'm gonna have to drink again. Well, but this is just a practice too, so. So like I said, especially at the beginning, if I if I can get my distance from from this guy and a lot of it's just it, it, it's not as quirky as as or not as gimmicky as Robin was leading me to believe, and of course I hit the wrong fucking button, so I'm drinking again, and I'm swinging when I should be rolling. <laughs> this may be a real quick, real quick uh, episode coming up here. All right. My 
biggest problem with this is just getting oriented half the time. Oriented, not oriented. Rolled twice and still got into it. Because he runs away from you a lot, or runs to the other side of you a lot. Gosh, that hurt. Frostbite there. As I lean away. I think I swung through that. Like, I I missed him and he missed me because we were both swinging at the same time. I wonder if... I'll have to try to remember to ask Robin about that. And now is when we start chasing him around. That was not good. Neither was that. All right. I really do, I think, I almost think I can swing through this. Like, like if you swing at the same time he's swinging. Ah. Drinking again, my timing on my drinking. And I can never dodge that one, so... And I'm swinging when I should be drinking. See, if you can get into a rhythm with him, but you gotta stay right on him, because he so gets away from you so quickly. Again, I'm sorry, I'm trying to concentrate here and... <sighs> also, button matching with this one is really, really hurts you because a lot of times I know, especially like there, like... Ugh. A drink. But now I'm down to my last Estus, so that's another thing with this guy, too, is that and I can't beat him. I mean, I guess if I beat him, we're witness here at this point. Ah. Wow. Okay. Alright, so we are Doing a little more training today. Not sure how we're going to use this or if we're going to use it. Well, we're going to try, so you'll likely see this, this one. But we're not, we're not even sure if you will see this in terms of the uh, the the talk or the lack of talk, the level of content, the quality of content, the journey. To each of these bosses so it, it we likely are gonna show the boss training and I didn't even get past this guy on my last one that you will never see for that very reason that you don't need to see the last thing we need to do is document me dying any more than we have to on this channel and he's gonna be still alive because I did not see the Just in case we don't. Um, I'm gonna take some Robin. If he does come down, he may be. I'm gonna go ahead and drink here. <clears throat> so, the idea is I am training for the channel. Come on, we all know when I jump, it's a screw up. Even though I practice jumping, I practice jumping, I uh, I don't jump. I really just, I just don't have that memory, that muscle memory. Robin calls it muscle memory. 
when you just know what buttons to press, you don't think about it. Probably very akin to any other athletic skill, uh, you know, reflex and all of that, like batting and you know, catching a ball, all of that stuff. And yes, I actually think that there is enough skill. I, I do think there's a certain sport element to, uh, to video games. Frozen thing! And let's drink here. Trying to keep a better eye on the stamina and the health bar. I'll tell you one thing about this guy that bugs me. I still don't know if it's a man or a woman. Uh, is you gotta be right up on top of this thing to get it. And I hate having to... Well, certainly didn't dodge that. I should have drunk there. Well, that worked out well for me, even though it was nothing that I did. Away. State frame here. A little more casual this uh, recording, too, uh, for these. Uh -oh. I... When is he going to turn into the thing? Oh, now. And I also lose his, I lose uh, his mark, not his mark, um, targeting. I lose his targeting a lot. I did learn that I don't, I, I think I was rolling too much. Did I get staggered in there? I'm rolling too much, like I, oh, like one roll, even though it looks like a lot, Now he's going to charge me, right? I still couldn't get away from it. I need to heal up here. I don't know if that kind of worked out for me, I think. When I do best with him, it's kind of when I, I kind of dodge and then, and then hit him once or twice. And then I'm fine. Until, until he comes right back and completely scrambles my, ah, like that. Now he's gonna race me, he's gonna rush me. Because Robin said I need to stay close to him and then he won't do those rushing things. But I've also gotta remember to dodge. It's a lot to, Never get that. Okay, I'm gonna drink. Down to Forestus. Close to having to quit anyway. Ah, so frustrating. 